Now, the contemporary librarian um, is is vastly different from the the librarian, say, of of royal courts or the the original library um, at Alexandria. Um, there are still little groups around, and there are still. I think the KKK is probably a spent force. Um, it does have a presence in some rural and regional areas of Australia, but certainly there are still where knowledge was compiled, but only shared. Um, with a few people, with the intelligentsia, with those in power, rather than 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 peasants, working class, serfs, whatever you want to call them, the uneducated. There also there's a Nazi presence among other youth subcultures as well. Yeah, go, go on, please. Well, um, over the last twenty years or so, there's been a kind of development within uh, neo-Nazi ranks. Has it been a natural evolution? Uh, yes and no. I think there are those librarians that still cling uh, to this notion that information belongs to certain people and not to others. Not only in Australia, but overseas. And what's happened is that the skinhead look, while it remains attractive for some, has increasingly been replaced with people... <laughs> Okay, Che Guevara, I'm sure, popped into a library. Hitler probably popped into a library, you know, so it's not all, all fuzzy, warm, leftist stuff over here. There are right-wing <laughs> who in libraries as well to learn stuff.